Losing by uh, 27. Not 28. 20. We did, we did uh, 26. Yeah. They're very similar, I don't know. Okay, so we'll do 20, uh, 27. Right. person is not deemed an expert amulet maker until um, three of his scripts heal three different people. Or with this one. So we'll go to 28. However, one script brought about healing three times. Even for merely one person, this particular amulet is considered as reliable for any person. Any person is permitted to go out wearing this amulet on Shabbos. It can be assumed that the healing can be attributed to the reliable amulet and not to the muzzle of the person who is ill. In contrast, when three different scripts heal one person on three separate occasions, none of them are deemed as reliable amulet. Hence, the healing must be attributed to the muzzle of a person, either that of the healer who wrote the scripts, or that of the ill person who was healed by the scripts. Accordingly, the healer is not established as an expert because of, it, of this act, because perhaps it was the muzzle of that person who was ill that led to the healing. When in contrast, his scripts healed three people, it can be assumed that the healing is dependent on the muzzle of the healer, since his, since his expertise was established with three different people. He's just a lucky guy. So therefore, that, then that, that uh, amulet you shouldn't wear.